You know, I've heard so many Team Irene people talk about, oh, you have to listen to what Irene said in Zach's interview because that's the truth. I'm one that, whether you're Team Irene or not, I think you have to put together what everybody says from then till now to come to a conclusion. But let's see. Let's compare a couple of statements. Let's see if this works without getting slapped with the flag. He asked her, how did you feel about the young lady from Minnesota? They did a full video on her conclusion. All right. So let's see what Keila Brown from St. Paul, Minnesota was saying. She went live originally September the 10th at 9 p.m. Chicago time. And as you hear her talking, I'm not going to play the whole thing right now, but she's going to start out by saying that she done spent a whole two to four hours researching the entire case and she has the entire thing figured out. For about hours, what time is there now? That's the right time? on the couch for about two, three hours, dude. It's about nine o'clock, dude. You're tripping. Nigga, I've been on that. I've been sitting. Nigga, remind y'all. I've been sitting hours. here for hours, my nigga. When I tell y'all, I don't read screenshots. I don't read comments. I don't. But listen, everybody's, everybody's focused on all the wrong shit. Everybody Her biggest mistake is uh, jumping the gun too fast. Let's see what some of the comments are here. That's one her beat up looking. Okay. Okay. I can't believe I wasted my time watching this uninformative BS. Fed up with the hood detectives. Manly ass voice. So it looks like the comments are more interested in What they think of her. Okay, let's see what else we got. Now, this is a little quick live she did, like only a minute long. Seems to me like she's hating because somebody else is doing a Kanika video. I don't know. Y'all, this, these, this is this right here is the problems we have in. With Kanisha, with Kanika's case right now, it's been. She call her Kanisha. We having with Kanisha, with Kanika's case right now. It's bitches like her. That's why I'm having a problem with people so angry about my video going viral. Exactly what is this bitch's point? To avoid copyrights. At the beginning of this video, though, why do you have to do all this? is about a, somebody that's kids that just died, bitch. But, Miss Brown, aren't you a stripper, too? And weren't you twirling around in your tiny little Daisy Dukes when you did yours? We'll go back and look again. You wanted to give a, a, a strip, strip tease first? Supposedly... At the her hotel party for her At the I-Ho. And like she don't even know how to talk. We done with her. We done, y'all. We fucking done. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a little jealousy. Let's see. I just noticed his first comment over here. They said, you've been watching for hours but don't know anyone's name. I don't... I thought that everybody was just all believing in this woman. Apparently... A lot of people weren't. I believed her for about five minutes, but let's see what she says. Because I think she was doing just as much coochie coochie as the rest of them. I sat down on, what time was it when I sat down on the couch, my nigga? Since like four o'clock. 
Since like, okay. All right, my life started. So, I've been sitting on this motherfucking couch, my nigga, for about hours. What time is there now? That's the right time? I've been on the couch for about two, three hours, dude. It's about nine o'clock, dude. You're tripping. Nigga, I've been on that. I've been sitting. Nigga, remind y'all. I've been sitting here for hours, my nigga. When I tell y'all, I don't read screenshots. I don't read comments. I don't. But listen, everybody's everybody's focused on all the wrong shit. So if everybody want to know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the little girl that got killed in Chicago and left in the refrigerator. On my life, I done figured the whole situation out, my nigga. See, everybody, everybody watching that live video, everybody's paying attention to all the wrong shit. Meanwhile, I got my superstitious. Geechee voodoo ass reading between the motherfucking lines. I guarantee you, I promise you. Chicago, y'all better pay me. Cause I'm solving, I done solved the murder for y'all. I don't solve the whole situation for y'all. I just don't know the people. But y'all, when y'all find the people, I'm telling y'all exactly what happened. This is exactly what happened. Okay, now. That's all I could take it out. Alright, let's go back to Irene and see what she says. Alright, remember the question he asked her? He goes, how do you feel about the young lady from Minnesota? She was from, uh, what you call it? Oh, the cheesehead place, whatever. Uh, and about her doing the full video with her conclusion. Irene says, she thinks she FBI. You don't even know what's going on. In reference to Kate, Kayla. Zach asked us, so her false, her statement was false? Irene repeats, false. Then she says, you don't even know nothing. Then she see the second live. She goes live again. You steady going live and don't even know the facts. You don't know nothing. And this is all in reference to uh, Kayla Brown. Then she says, then she says, it wasn't Irene. We see, we see, what'd she say? We see Kanika in the video. The fact is that Monifa girl let her out the hallway. So where'd she go? Monifa, I'm pretty sure, this is Monifa's best friend. If she knew where she going, or whatever the case may be y'all saying, she would have told. She would have been open her mouth. This her real life best friend. Since the third grade. Zach says, so nobody had beef with Kanika. Irene repeats, nobody. She says, come on now, everybody loved Kanika. Kanika was the life of the party. Okay, then Zach asks, was she like a turnip queen? Irene says, that's what type of crowd we is. We all just like to have fun. So I guess the point of this video is I hear so many of the same people saying that you got to listen and believe Irene. Irene telling the truth. Then I hear the same people turn around and saying Did y'all see Kayla Brown's video live in the beginning? She was telling the truth. That's very contradictive of saying Irene's telling the truth and Kayla's telling the truth because they are speaking opposite of what actually happened. And that's where a lot of the new followers get confused because they're listening to people that they feel like have been researching the case for a long time. And to be honest with you, one thing I've learned for sure, it don't matter if you've been here since day one. It don't matter if you live in Chicago. If you have not researched 
and you've just been a follower, then that time doesn't matter. And when I say research, research is not going to YouTube and watching YouTube videos. It's not going into groups reading posts. Research is when you pull out that toxicology report and you go Google up every medical term on there to get a true definition of what that toxicology report says. That's what research is. I'm not watching a YouTube video of me reading you the, the, the toxicology report. And there's nothing wrong with the followers doing that. That's what followers do. Subscribers, viewers, whatever you want to call them. But those that are claiming, I've done my research, I've been here since the beginning. And then you make statements like this. That's not what research is. And no, that doesn't say that I know it all. It doesn't say that I have all the answers. I just know what the difference in researching versus being a social media viewer, follower type thing. And for the ones that are viewers and followers, yeah, we need y'all too because y'all give us, you know, that, that emotional support. Y'all sit there and y'all talk to us and ask questions and stuff. No matter whether you have a channel, you have a group, or, or you're just another, you know, fellow member in a group or something. But y'all are not the ones that I'm referring to that y'all aren't running around saying, oh, I did my research. I did my research. I'm talking to the ones that holler, I do my research when they really haven't. Or they their idea of what research is, is to go watch somebody's YouTube or to go read somebody's post. It's not the same. That's why the results aren't the same. 